There are some tips on the words and vocabularies that we use in finances, but they're not as important because some people just use them in a wrong place. And it doesn't matter. As long as you understand what's happening, it's okay. But just because you're here, I want to make sure to cover some stuff for you. So the, the difference between gains and profits. So gains are the money that you have, you make from the proceeds of selling something above its purchase price. So let's say you buy something, let's say you buy these AirPods and you buy them for, let's say $100 and you sell them for $120. That $20 is your gain, right? So that's why in some businesses, they use gain and loss statement instead of in statement of or um, income statement, the term, right? The other word or term that we have is profit. Profit is the money that is left for your business after uh, deducting all of your expenses from all of your revenues, right? Whatever you made minus whatever you paid and some extra stuff that we are not going to talk about right now, that would be your profit. We have gross profit and we have net profit. So that doesn't matter right now. So the difference between gains and profits are kind of like gains are you have an item, you sell it for some money, that money is your gain. Profit is all your revenue min minus all of your expenses. That would be your profit in your business. The other two words that can be used in substitutions of each other, but actually have different meanings are revenues and income. So revenue is all the money that you've made before deducting your expenses. Income, or actually better said, net income is when you deduct all of your expenses from your revenue. So that's the bottom line. Another word that you want to learn is the bottom line. Bottom, bottom line is your net income. Top line is your revenue. So when they, when they talk about top line, we, our top line is this much means our revenue is this much. If they say bottom line, it means that net income is this much. So net income is a little bit more important. It depends. All of these are stories that you need to understand, but net income is is kind of more like reality, what is left. But top line or your revenue is that, okay, you made this much, but how much did you spend, right? Somebody might say, I made 100,000 from ads. Okay, how much did you pay for the ads? Maybe they paid 110000 so it means that they didn't make anything and they actually lost 10000 So be aware of these words and pay attention to them because some people use these words to actually create something that is super exciting, but in reality, they are not. <laughs> If you like this video, know that we dive deeper into details of everything and we talk about all the different ways of making more money at Cafe Society. Specifically this month, we talked about different ways of diversifying and making more money. If this is something that is interesting to you and you want to join, feel free to send us a message, reach out to us either here, give us your contact info or email us or message us on Instagram. Any way that you can find us, you can uh, message us. And we will include our information in the description of this video as well so that you can reach us easily and um, we can give you more info on Cap Society and we would love, love, love to have you. I cannot wait to see you live and in Cap Society. See you next time. Bye.